Hey guys, Steven here and we have an official statement from Flex Wheeler. He made a post on his Instagram, as you can see this photo right here. This is his right leg that was amputated right below the knee. It's really hard to think about this uh, now that I see it actually. It's really, it's really hard for me to think about this because this is the ultimate legend of bodybuilding. Anyways, let's read his statement uh, that he made. So he says... I would like to thank all of my fans and bodybuilding colleagues for your prayers and support during this difficult time for me and my family. My surgery was required due to escalating circulation difficulties in my right leg that had become life-threatening. I am resting comfortably now and have begun my rehabilitation. I would like to thank my superb medical team for my treatment and care. Any and all interviews and or articles relating to my medical condition, procedures, and or current status is speculation and unauthorized. I will keep all of you updated on my progress via my social media outlets with official Flex Wheeler updates. So there you go, guys. Now at least you know what happened. It's a circulation problem that became life-threatening. And that's why this surgery or the amputation was necessary so he would actually survive. Now, what is the cause of it? What caused the circulation problems? That would be the speculation that he doesn't like us to make. And as you can see right here, it was interesting for me that he says any and all interviews and or articles are unauthorized. So, as far as I know, there is only that one interview with uh, Sean Ray where he was speculating about his medical condition, the reasons why this happened and so on. So, he was probably referring to that. He did not like Sean Ray coming to RX Muscle and giving that interview about him. Because that was speculation and yeah, he did use the opportunity to promote his show. Which is, in my opinion, very low from Sean Ray because he's supposed to be friends with Flex Wheeler. And apparently right here you can see that Flex Wheeler doesn't like that. And when he says all the articles, he is considering probably my videos as well. But I don't think he saw my videos because my channel is a little bit smaller than some of the other channels. But still, I mean, yeah, I understand him not liking it, but that's what we do. We are reporters, so sometimes there just isn't a lot of information and we have to do some speculation. I tried personally to be very respectful to Flex Wheeler, but at least now the speculation may end because we have an official statement. And yeah, it's official, so he lost his right leg below the knee. I'm not sure about that part. I hope it's below the knee because if he has the knee, it's much easier for him to use the prosthetics compared to not having a knee, but still, this is a disaster, really. But at least he will not be in pain anymore. He says he's resting comfortably. And with all the family and all the support from all of his fans and so on, it will be a good recovery for him. He will recover. It will take some time for that wound to heal and later to get used to prosthetics, but it could be worse. So it's not that bad, really. He didn't die like some other bodybuilders. So that's about it for this video, guys. I just wanted to share this with you in case you haven't seen it already. So Flex Wheeler just made an official statement and uh, this is it. So he had a surgery. It required an amputation below the knee. And now he's in hospital. He's resting and uh, recovering slowly. So this is going to do it for this video, guys. Uh, Flex, recover fast and bye-bye, uh, guys.